Hello, this is Andrew Kohlmeier at Andrew Kohlmeier Massage, and today we, I would like to talk about bladder urgency and the medical massage approach at relieving bladder symptoms. So typically what happens when you have bladder symptoms is you have pressure on your sacrum. These are where all the nerves come out of your sacrum that control your bladder function and rectal function and, uh, you know, so it's really common to have the urgency when you have the pressure in there. It's like the receptors for the bladder just don't read right and you have, you always have the sensation like your bladder is full. So to relieve that, um, we, we want to try to address and see if there's lymphatic flow problems. So this, this will cause, cause uh, local swelling in this whole area outlined in red. So you want to re reduce that obviously to, to get the pressure off of these bladder nerves so they can actually function properly. So all of this area for the legs and hip sacrum is all drained by this structure right here called the cisterna chile, and that's located at the vertebrae L2. So if this is really tight here along the sides of the vertebrae, your legs just fill up, and then you have this pressure on these bladder nerves. So what we want to do is we want to reduce all that so we want to make sure we get the hip loosened up, you know, so it can flow into there. And I've made a video before on lymphatic drainage that covers it maybe a little bit more in depth. But basically it's like you have to restore flow into this cisterna chile at L2. So you want to make sure that, um, you know, also that the knee isn't causing problems. This is the gracilis muscle off the pes and serene. There's three big muscles that kind of attached there and it seems like gracilis is the one that really causes issues with uh, bladder urgency. So you want to make sure that you're, you clean up around this area so you're just going to do some deep friction kind of techniques. And that's, that's basically the, the gist of medical massage is, is um, soft tissue mineralization reduction techniques and that's mostly deep, deep friction with little glide on the skin surface so just to you know we're going to get in there and clean that up. And, what that's going to do it's that that's like the control center for this muscle so if it's too tight here it's just going to lock this muscle up and then you can get actually mineralization into that muscle itself so you're going to want to reduce that to and this is also responsible for draining the medial sacrum here it seems like the kind of like the leg is divided in half as far as drainage so it's really reliant upon you know, getting these to relax so it's not, you know, hogging up the, the, compart the compartmental space in the leg there. So, yep, so, you know, we got that okay. And then the hip, you know, you have a muscle called piriformis that's going to come across there. You want to make sure that's in good check. And, uh, you know, just whatever you can do to restore the flow back into this cistern and chile, you know. Some, some deep techniques into here, you know, pushing around and cleaning up if there's any mineralization in the, into there. And, you know, once you have this pressure down, the, the, the symptoms should uh, resolve pretty, pretty much immediate. But it might take a day or two. And, uh, you know, sometimes people have bladder function loss. There's sphincters in there that control, like, your bladder function. You know, sometimes you can get a little bit of improvement in, in that as well with the pressure off. All right, so that's the medical, medical massage approach for bladder urgency. Thanks. Bye.